A news just coming in, the Assam police has arrested Congress MLA Afta Aftabuddin Mola uh, for allegedly making derogatory remarks about Hindu priests and saints. Uh, this is uh, news that's just coming in. Uh, we're now learning that uh, Mola has been arrested for making anti-Hindu remarks. We are still awaiting for more information to come in from uh, uh, the police in terms of the FIR that was filed against him. But uh, uh, he has been held for making uh, what is being seen as anti-Hindu remarks. Anirudha is joining us on the phone line. Anirudha, please tell us more. Uh, yes, Zubur Aftarputin Mulla, the MLA from Jolisar constituency in Assam has been arrested on uh, Wednesday morning following a uh, complaint that was uh, lodged with the police on uh, Tuesday. Uh, remember, uh, Aftarputin Mulla made a derogatory statement on Hindus, particularly the Hindu priests and Namgorias, who are the caretakers of the Pishnavite uh, prayer houses in Assam on Monday while addressing a political uh, gathering and uh, he, he said that uh, uh, in order to save the crime and the sins committed by the Hindu priests, uh, the Hindus often blame the Muslims. He also went on to say that whenever there is a, a rape or any other crime, the names which are associated with such crimes are often that of Hindu priests, sadhus, as well as Nam Goryas. Following this, a uh, controversy was sparked across the state, and on Tuesday, uh, a complaint was lodged by Deepak Kumar Das. In fact, uh, on Tuesday, Assam Chief Minister Dr. Himanta Biswa Sharma had also said that uh, those who have made derogatory statements, particularly on Hindu deities and Hindu priests, and have tried to equate Lord Krishna with uh, Navziha, will not be spared, and already several cases are there against us individuals in different police stations, and at, uh, from time to time, police has been taking action against this. Following this, uh, on Wednesday early morning, uh, the Jaleshwar constituency MLA, Abdulbin Mullah, has been arrested. Meanwhile, it may be mentioned that uh, the Congress party uh, had landed into a sub controversy following the statement made by the uh, by their own MLA, and uh, in order to save the face on Tuesday, the Congress had also uh, fo was forced to uh, so cause the MLA in question, Nupur. Thank you, Anirudha, for joining us and bringing us uh, the latest on that. So, uh, the BJP, in fact, has now uh, hit out at the India line, saying that after the attacks on Sanatan Dharma, the opposition is now attacking Hindu saints. Congress Party and India Alliance's Hindu Virodhi DNA has been exposed when Congress MLA from Assam, Aftabuddin Molla, has now abused and insulted Hindu sadhu saints and pujaris by saying that why is it that all the rapists are Hindu sadhus and saints and Nam Gharias. This shows the mindset of the Congress. This is the same Congress Party that denied existence of Prabhu Shri Ram. This is the same Congress Party that opposed Ram Mandir that says Hindu is a dirty word. Hindu terror, Hindu to his ISIS and Boko Haram, all of this was coined by the Congress party. Ironically, Congress says it's a party of Janudhari Hindus. Will Rahul Gandhi take action on this? Ever since the Mumbai meeting has taken place of the India Alliance, there is an agenda that Hindu ko do gali taki mile vote bank ki tali. Right from Mr. Stalin who talks about elimination of Sanatan, Khadge ji compares it to diseases. Then we have also seen how Congress party leaders, RJD leaders, Samajwadi party leaders have consistently attacked Hindu faith. They have attacked Ram Charitmanas, applying Tilak. Today, Rahul Gandhi, Mamta Banerjee, Akhilesh Yadav, Mr. Arvind Kejriwal, they must tell us, will they take action on this or will they continue to support such statements because the entire alliance has decided that the Sanatan Hindu faith should be attacked. So on the phone line is Mr. Zarika. He's the BJP MLA and, and Assam Minister. Uh, Mr. Zarika, uh, uh, the arrest has been very swift in this case. Uh, however, do you see this essentially as uh, the Congress's plank to divide vote packs? Total uh, planning of Congress uh, to dishonor Sanatan Dharma. 
whether it is in Tamil Nadu, whether it is in Assam, or every part of the country, it is the same. I think it is a direction from Congress High Command to defend Sanatan Dharmi, to defend Hindu, to disrespect, to, uh, to hate Hindu. And uh, this is happening since this last couple of years, and it is done by Congress only. Congress has a total hatred uh, to the uh, to Hindu dharma, to Sanatan dharma, and and this is the result. These are the result. So I I have condemned so seriously, strongly. So in, at least they should respect our dharma. They should not hate our dharma. All right, Mr. Zarika, thank you very much for joining us. Uh, so, Piyusha Zarika over there talking, talking about uh, uh, how he believes this is the right action uh, to be taken. Now, uh, the BJP, of course, has hit out at the India Alliance saying that the attacks on Sanatan uh, are just continuing and the opposition is also now attacking Hindu saints.